um, about three weeks ago, we had um, a lot of customers not knowing what was going to happen. So there was an influx of customers coming into the store purchasing lots and lots of food and litter, uh, primarily. You know, um, interesting you know, fact about our business is um, the, the primary uh, products that we sell, about 70, 80% of that is dog and cat food. And that's just about what everybody was buying. Um, and uh, for a bit there, my distributors and suppliers were concerned that they wouldn't be able to keep up the demand. Um, the thing about pet, su pet supplies and, and pet food is that the shelf life is a lot longer than your groceries. Um, usually the distributors and the manufacturers have a few months surplus of the product on hand because your average bag of food is typically good on the shelf for about a year or so. But as of now, I think everything's kind of hit a point where we're back into a groove, you know, we're, we're at regular stock levels and there hasn't been an issue of shortages, just a couple here and there.